What is Halloween in New York? It's scary. It's like the zombie apocalypse. Being the most unapologetically you. Adventure, creativity. Crazy as fuck. I want my mommy. <laughs> After the pandemic, Halloween is back with a vengeance. Halloween adventure. Halloween adventure. Halloween adventure. Halloween adventure is a New York institution. We made it into the greatest Halloween store in the world and the biggest one in New York City. This place was more than just a retail store. It's a safe space for all of LGBT and the alternative community. My staff. They're punk, they're comedians, they're artists. I love people that are pierced, tattooed. If they had one leg, that seemed great. They're a pirate. Somebody like me can have a job doing something. I love to do, look the way I want, be who I am. This is a community and a family here. Tony, who founded the store, retired. The new corporate owners closed the Halloween store. I had this idea to reopen the store and bring everybody back for one last Halloween. Like many small businesses in New York, they are shutting their doors after this grand finale Halloween season. You worried the store might not survive? This is our final year, the big last hurrah. I walked through the building once again, overcame with emotion. I was thankful that we had another chance. The store really is back to life. Everyone's ready to unleash and party like rock stars. Well, Village Halloween Parade is officially coming back. People are ready to go crazy again. They're coming out of the subways. There's an excitement in the air. It just gets to a fever pitch. There is a lot of activity on the street, but a lot of stores and a lot of venues have closed down. It might be up to us to shake yeah. it up. Ladies and gentlemen, do not open any of the packages. Anybody else need any help today? Keep it moving through this walkway. Welcome to the madness. I was trying really hard, all my heart and soul, to keep the store going, but I knew it was only temporary. It feels like when you're graduating high school and everybody's going in different directions. Brick and mortar stores are closing. Everything is online. I don't smell people's bad breath or smell their farts. Here, when you come in here, you know, you smell the farts. That's silliness. How do we keep entire neighborhoods from becoming boring? How do we keep life on the streets happening? Halloween celebrations are back and better than ever. Costumes flying off the shelves. That store would have not opened without Stitch. If it is the last Halloween, then we're going to go out with a bang. It's time to get back out in the street, celebrate New York's diversity, and party like it's 2019. Happy Halloween. <laughs>